Okay, hi there. So in this video, I'm going to show you how to add parameters to your routes. And the reason you would want to do this is maybe you have, so two lessons, for example, you've got two pages that are pretty much the same. They just have different content, um, but otherwise they have the same layout and everything. So here, this one is a parameter because it's lesson ID. So that gets passed in as one for ID. And I also have lesson two. So here it says lesson two up here, and it's the same page. It's the same lesson ID dot page route, uh, but it just has a different parameter, which is one or two or three or four or five. So how to add that? You just put it in brackets right here, whatever you want the prop to be called. And then you need to add this to the top of your script. Context equals module preload page page dot ID. And this right here is what will be passed in as a prop to this page. Okay, so the parameter basically becomes a prop. So you'll need to accept it, export let ID, and then you can use it just like normal. So what I did, for example, is I have my lessons here. I probably want to move that into a different page eventually, but uh, for now it's right there and it gets the content. So if it's a one, it'll get this one. If it's a two, it'll get this one. And I also have it change my title. So this is how you can make a dynamic page with different um, data based on the parameter. Let me just go through that again. Brackets, put in your prop. Add this to the top of your page, preload page, blah, blah, blah. ID, this is your prop. Okay, that's all, bye.